She's like a star already. Pause, pause. Um, one, the confidence in this young little girl is so high. Um, I wish we as adults were able to keep that confidence uh, within ourselves, especially as performers, because this is so inspirational. I'm very impressed by her sound. The amount of restraint and the amount of poise and the professionalism gorgeous operatic voice you guys i did not expect that i was expecting like a beautiful kid you know her to come out and sing like in her beautiful like baby voice and then bam she just hits you in her in your face so much control and power oh my goodness that she has over her voice is astonishing like how old is she here unbelievable is she like a trained singer or is this, this something that naturally comes to her because oh my god so much power in her <laughs> Right there it's one thing to go that high that's one thing but to be able to cut the breath on the reverse on that that's insane she's like going ah uh, ah uh, that's impressive listen for that <laughs> You can see just by looking at her eyes how much she's getting into it when she closes her eyes and they kind of roll back like she's very very into what she's doing not a singer I but it, it always interests me to see how each singer gets into this zone especially like really really phenomenal singers they take themselves outside of the world and they're they're on a whole different level like they're on a whole different astral plane than us some of these singers that i've seen lately I thought it was a different vocalist. Let's take me out for a second. That vibrato, bro. I wanted to stop it earlier and talk about how she sang like the still note and then let it flutter at the end. And it's just like to like just decide and have the control to do that the discipline to be able to do that and practice and rehearse and teach yourself to do that and then now she's got like these in her like kind of riffs and in her i don't know if they're runs they're kind of like more like legato notes but it has this really fast really rich vibrato still like so she's showing multiple layers of different vibrato
combination, her pitch is just something else. It is just something else. And she's still in the show. And I know she's probably not trying to, but she's for sure still in the show, in my opinion, as I'm sitting here. And I like seeing this, man. I like seeing the little guy. I like seeing the little guy playing this thing too, man. I think it's cool. Wow, that smile at the end. She knows what she did. She is, what, nine years old here? But she knows what she did. She knows what she did. <laughs> she knows the power of her voice. That's why she smiles at the end. Is that man actually standing on the table? <laughs> I mean, I mean, I, I this is, this is nothing short of a... Uh, if, if he he is doing the right thing, <laughs> standing on the table, it's a standing ovation on the table. about how great of a vocalist she is yes she's able to play like this without a metronome i should say vocalize like this without a metronome that's impressive in and of itself again she's 11 let's put that over here in the box so we agree that she's a great vocal performer commentaar van daniel mills in de afgelopen drie dagen heb ik maar liefst 12 andere uitvoeringen van dit prachtige nummer beluisterd amira is de jongste en de beste van hen Niemand komt ook maar in de buurt van deze prachtige vertolking van Amira. Dit is mijn nieuwe favoriete Amira nummer. Commentaar van Mortimer Zilg. Als dit niet het beste vocale optreden aller tijden is, weet ik niet wat het is. Het is het beste dat ik ooit heb gehoord. Het is meer dan beste. Het is gewoon ongelooflijk. Commentaar van Robert Gomez, deze bewerking van het Eve Maria is geschreven door mijn broer William, kort voor zijn vroegtijdige dood in 2000. Hij heeft ons dit prachtige erfgoed nagelaten dat nu over de hele wereld wordt gezongen. Hij zou vooral blij zijn geweest als hij het door een jongere had horen zingen. Zoals het geval is met de betoverende Amira. Commentaar van Jaap Filius, hoe diep kun je kruipen in het nummer dat je speelt? Heel, heel diep. Dit gaat verder dan, normaal, zingen. Op het einde had Amira even tijd nodig om eruit te komen in, de echte wereld, dat zie je duidelijk. Er gebeurde iets in die kerk. Ik was er niet bij, maar ik kan het zien, kan het voelen. En ik ben er vrij zeker van dat alle mensen die erbij waren zich dit prachtige lied en dat moment kunnen herinneren als de dag van gisteren.